Hi guys, Hooks and Equestrian, and today I'm going to be showing you, and mostly describing to you, how to make homemade things for your sleigh. And today, it's for people, and they have horses this time, and today's items that I'm going to be showing you how to make are crops. Lunch wood. So here, I've already made. Oops. Four crops. I made out of toothpicks painted black, and with white or black ribbon. So that's a white ribbon, and then this is a black ribbon. You can also make it with brown or whatever color you want, but for the more traditional, it's black or white. So it should look like that. They fit perfectly in the owner can, or gym bog in this case. Because he has an open hand, like that, you just slip it right on in and just go to work now. I know he has a crop right here on the side but you can't really see it so this crop works really well. You can even move and it looks like it's meant to be for Schleich. And this is my lunch whip. It's quite long but it's meant to be long and I painted it black all sorry if you hear that noise <coughs> excuse me um all handles can either be painted brown or black but I like black and for this cord I have this whole bucket filled with colors for cords like purple, blue, orange, pink, white yellows, there's even a yellow in there, um, from a homestay student, and they're probably about one in one eighth of an inch thick, you could just do string or ribbon, but since I had the cord and I haven't used the cord for anything, uh, I decided that this would be very good to use up. So these would also be good for soft halter, which I'll be showing you all how to make soon, and so what you do is you grab a toothpick and you paint it black. Then you get a hot glue gun and you would put glue right on the tip of it. Then you would grab your cord and place it onto the end of the stick and hold it. Then you would grab some the color, whatever the co this cord is, grab this thing called ribbon and you would just wrap around it like this so it looks a little bit more neater and that is how you do a lunch whip for a crop what you would want to do is you want to cut it cut a toothpick in half I just use these gardening shears things you cut it in half and with the pointy side is the handle then you would grab about an inch of ribbon, that's what it's called, and cut it and then glue one side. And you glue then you push the ribbon onto it. You glue the other side. And however big you want the crop, that's how much you cut and put on. So if you guys need a little bit more of a like if you actually guys if you guys want me to actually show you how to do it step by step, I will do it. Just you have to ask. And someone asked um, let me see who it was. I think it was. It was Animals764 who asked me to do a tutorial on how to make my cow barn. I'm still asking my dad about that if he can do it. But if not, I will give you step, in step by step instructions on how to do it. So thanks for watching, and if you need. 
better instructors how to do this, comment below.